Hi there, welcome back. It's Priestess and Medium Roslyn. Welcome back, Soul Family. It's time for your reading today. I'm looking forward to spending some time with you and maybe you can discover some things that have been bothering you or plaguing you for a while. Just know that I'm here for you and we can look at this and put our heads together and figure out some things you may need to know and understand in your life. So you can reach me in the description box below. I am available for phone calls during the day. Uh, also, your concerns with uh, root work, conjure, magical oils, candles, bath salt soaps, all the things that I've been creating and shamanic healing for years. So don't give up hope. Enjoy your reading and be blessed today. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Welcome back. It's time. Scorpio, it's time for your uh, how do they truly feel about you reading where you can tune into what this person may be thinking and feeling and what's surrounding them, what may be going on with them since the two of you may not be in very good contact anymore. This could also be someone who you're with and the two of you have not really spoken in depth about what may really be on your mind. Okay, so let's tune into this. If you would like to um, schedule something private with me, my information is below. I hope you're blessed and well. Thank you for being part of the soul family, Scorpio. It's almost July. Almost July. And I feel like love is really going to be different this summer for so many of you, Scorpio. Because we're having so many different circumstances. Circumstances we never would have dreamed of last summer. Mother, Father, God, blessed Holy Spirit, please come through and let us know what to expect for Scorpios who are wondering about this person, their thoughts, their feelings, their actions towards this person. Blessed Holy Spirit, Mother, Father, God, please let us know now. Let's see here. We have the lovers, the wheel, the two of wands. Okay, there's definitely, um, for some of you Scorpios watching this person, they're in love with you. They want to move forward with you. They're willing to explore with you. Um, they may not have fully made up their mind yet, Scorpio, that this is really truly what they want to do. Okay, but it could be a little bit of um, organization, a little bit of being open-minded. Um, maybe there'll be some situations that play out in their family life, in their job, um, in their creativity to help them to make this decision, you know, that they really would like to spend time with you and be with you. Okay, I love this card. I love it. It looks like Tupac. <laughs> and they're so in love and we had the wheel here i mean this is really the energy of them making up their mind how they truly feel about the love and moving forward with you okay so for some of you scorpios i feel like this person will get in touch with you they will want to explore with you let's see what else is going on for some of you here watching could be scorpios it could be the cross watcher watching Okay, so I see more of your energy here with the King of Cups, Four of Pentacles, and okay, and the Fool. So someone here, even though they may not fully be expressing it to you, Scorpio, they may have it in their mind that they really are emotional about you, that they may even, some of you may even have a child with this person. Some of you could be pregnant right now. It's a very strong energy of uh, someone giving over their heart their love, their emotions. Um, at times you may wonder, Scorpio, what is really going on with this person because they are being emotional and they're staying with that, you know, but they're very uh, stable. They're very rock solid here with this four of pentacles here where they're holding on to something. And maybe it's something from the past that they're just not sure if they're really making up their mind to move forward with all of this emotion they have. I also see the fool here. So 
this person, I feel if they do reach out to you, Scorpio, if they do contact you, it's going to feel like a brand new path with this person. So whatever it was going on before between the two of you, I just don't see that it will be the same because, yeah, here we have the Ace of Cups, ultimate love and fulfillment, the star, healing, Ace of Wands, brand new beginnings with you. So Scorpio, this could be a very passionate Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. This could be another uh, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, someone who is very fluid, very energetic with their emotions. I feel like between the two of you, you probably were doing pretty good for a while. I mean, it seems like the energy is here and it's prominent for happiness, love, and for showing all this emotion. The star is very healing. You've got the Ten of Cups with the star. So this person, I feel like they they will reach out to you. For some of you Scorpios watching, I can't say everyone because it's not a private read. But for some of you, I feel like this person is going to reach out to you. And they are going to somehow find the balance here. Because what I'm seeing here is the two of wands here. I'm seeing the two of pentacles. I'm seeing the five of cups. There was some kind of heartbreak and there was some kind of decision where they may not have let go of someone in their past. Someone who they had a previous relationship with. Maybe they're not willing to let go fully of a lifestyle and feel that if they commit to you fully, Scorpio, that they won't have all the choices that they used to have. There's something that they have to kind of grieve over. They have to make a decision and grieve over whatever this is. And for some of you, I, I really feel this person may make the decision to come back and return. So Scorpio, this kind of feels like, this kind of feels like a reconciliation read. It really does. It, it just has that energy and that tone that this person may come back and want to start a new cycle with you. That's really the way it feels what I'm getting, Scorpio. All right, so that is your reading on how this person is feeling, the energy surrounding them. Um, I hope you have a blessed and wonderful rest of your day, Scorpio. And if you'd like to get in touch with me, my information is below, okay? Take care. Bye-bye.